I gotta go pick up some packages from my front office. Also, uh, Ashley will be home shortly. So maybe, uh, maybe we should make it a longer break then. Okay. Hmm. I can just start while you go do your shit. Okay. I will, I will come back after probably it'll be like an hour and a half, but I will be back. So. Pat is going to go get eggnog, yeah. No, that's not what I, no way. Okay, here we go. Got you guys later. Okay, now that we're all alone, Jackal, let's see how this works. I don't actually play competitive matches with local or online. I don't know how this game works. Change your Twitch title and such. Man, fuck off. I can't do that. You want me to do everything? Fine. I'll go into Twitch. It's got to be called something different. Or maybe I should just play Subnautica. Yeah, let's just let's just play. Jackal, how do you feel about me just playing Subnautica instead of this? Yeah, Subnautica. Okay, I'm down. Let's do that instead. Hold on one second. I'm gonna I'm gonna flip I'm gonna flip the flip the shit. Okay, here we go. We live now. Okay, now I have to change the stream title. Okay, here I go. I gotta pull up a dashboard. Normally, Pat just handles all this shit for me, so I don't have to worry about this thing. Let us see settings. No, I'm just so I'm I'm, I'm like legit getting old, dude. I like don't understand how to use the fucking internet sometimes. And it's not that I like am forgetting how to do stuff, it's just that there's so much new stuff. Dude, there is no stream delay now, so nice. Nice. <laughs> I fucking played this game for four hours. That's nuts. Doesn't really feel like it was that long. I guess sometimes when you're streaming, it just like goes by super fast. Like that, that uh, I've went back and I'm editing the, the Sans Genocide Run fight now. And we were, I was streaming for like five fucking hours, but I swear to God, when I was doing it, it felt like, like it happened like that. Like I thought it was like 30 minutes tops and I look and it was like five hours later and I was like, oh, well, it's, it's bedtime. That's, that's ominous. I don't like that. Now when I yell at you to get air, you can go and not die. Lameho. Yeah, that'll be great, dude. But that requires me to actually look at the chat is the thing. Um, okay. It says power restored, but the power's still going down. This is not good. I'm just gonna go straight up, because fuck. Do I have- I don't have my Seamoth or anything, do I? I'm just gonna go straight up, yeah. Charging the batteries is gonna take a lot of power. Yeah, maybe I should take the batteries out of the- You know what, I have so much oxygen, so, so just fuck it. I'm probably gonna go back down and just take the batteries out of the charging thing. That's smarter. So that I don't fucking die in the night. Well, there goes the power. But I'm not taking damage or anything. So, I think it's okay. I was expecting when the power ran out for myself to just fucking die. But it looks like it's fine. No power because it's night. You're going to have to not use anything until morning. Yeah. Makes sense. Question I have, though, is... Do I have enough to make more solar panels and stuff? I think one of the things that I... One of the reasons I stopped playing this game last time is because I fucking turned all my quartz into glass. Which is, you can't make solar panels out of. You can't make solar panels out of glass. You have to use raw quartz for it, which is kind of fucking stupid. You know what, since it's not fucking me up anyway, I'm just gonna put all these batteries back in there, so fuck it. It's also really fucking dark. I forgot how dark this game was. Um, let's see, which thing do I want to build? Let's do an L compartment like this. How do I rotate it? That's like that, huh? What? How come I can't build that? Why won't it let me build this? Hello? Is there something in the way or something? No, it won't. It just won't let me, it just doesn't like that one. Uh, let me try a different thing then jackal can you tell me why it won't let me build this am i too close to it oh wait there's a vent down there can i use that for thermal energy i probably can't right it's probably not hot water it's probably just regular water that's moving i have no fucking clue to be honest yeah me neither oh, i found quartz nice um quartz yes so now i can make more solar panels i really wonder why it's not letting me build more compartments though i know my oxygen's low but I'll, I'll probably make it back. I have the beacon to show me where to go. It's not like last time where I would fucking have to just like blindly try to find my way back to the base. Which I know everyone loved. Oh god, my fucking knees. I'm such an old man, dude. So I'm gonna deconstruct this and build it in a slightly different place. So that I can get more solar panels. Like... That. It, it probably doesn't matter the way they're facing, right? I don't think it does. Just a text like, is it daytime or not, I think. So it would be destroyed. I don't think you can build there because there's something on the wall and it would be destroyed. Oh, that makes sense. There's an internal structure that would be destroyed. Okay, that makes sense. Um, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. 
Nothing on the wall there. There's something on the wall there, but... I don't know why it won't let me build here, is the thing. Let's see, it won't let me like build like this. There's nothing on that wall. Maybe the locker's just too close to the wall? And if that's the case, then I have to fucking do a lot of work, because I don't have enough room in my inventory to empty that locker. Um, I guess I could make another locker? Maybe that makes sense. I could make another freestanding locker, like this. The piece underneath it might take up more space than it actually does. Oh, you mean the, the piece underneath the locker, or the piece underneath the tube thing I'm trying to build? Underneath the tube. But it, it might be this locker, though, right? I'll move the locker just in case. I do... I might have food? I don't quite know. Brian food, yes. Well, I mean, I still have enough to, to be okay for right now. Oh, I have so many fucking batteries in here. So now I can deconstruct this, right? Yeah, I can. Let me out. Maybe it's this piece right here that's keeping me from building? Oh no, it was. It was just that locker. Let me see my inventory. I have food somewhere, probably. I'm not worried. Let's build a straightaway compartment. Oh, I don't have enough titanium. Huh. Let me just go inside and grab some. We figured it out, yeah, yeah, man. Uh, that's cool looking, I guess. Um, can I move the battery charger? It is charging them little by little. What if I take out all of these? The power will shoot right back up, right? Uh, well, I don't know if shoot is the right word, actually. It will slowly meander back up. And then I want there to be, like... I want a multi-purpose room to be right there, but I don't have enough for that yet. Um, is there anything on this wall? There's something there, right? Oh, it's the fabricator. Um, yeah, that, that locker looks like ass. <laughs> so, um, dude, I, I've got to fucking go pee. I'll, I'll be right back. Uh, you can... I would say you can look at my dog, but she's gonna fucking, you know, just come with me, so it doesn't really matter. You need an actual room, to be honest. Uh, yeah. That leg. Yeah, I've got hairy-ass legs. Ow. Ow, fuck. I'll be back. Hello, bro. Okay, so let's do this. Um, I gotta now move this stupid fucking locker. I'll, I guess I'll build its replacement first. Um, no, not a wall locker. Jack will yell at me. He wants a regular locker. He wants a, he wants a big boy locker. Jackal only wants the best lockers. He's very picky about his lockers. The locker fits like twice the space, man. Yeah, no, it does. <laughs> what the fuck? Is my mouse broken? My mouse just stopped working. I can't let go of this thing. Uh, hello? I wonder what happened to that thing. Well, fixed it now. Oh, right. I should eat. How come no one told me to eat, man? This, this is horse shit. <laughs> oh, I forgot to. Yeah. That's, that's, that's your fault, Jackal. That's your fault. Uh, I don't have any food in here. Uh, well, I guess I'll just take first aid kits for now. I, I, my fucking base is so cluttered, dude, because I just have so much shit. Um, here we go. Uh, yeah, look at this rock. I'm gonna eat that shit up. What the fuck? It, it made a noise like I killed one of them, but I don't think I see it dead. What? Okay, there. Okay. So the, the knife is super good because it cooks them as you kill them. Which is just really good. Yeah, it's auto-cooked. It's real good. I think spadefish are really good because they give you water. They give you water and food. That's really good. Oh, these, these royal whatever, these pink things are really good. They give you a lot of nutrition. Get back here. I'm probably going a little nuts. Probably don't need to actually kill all of them. In fact, it's probably better if I don't. Does that thing have a charge or is it infinite? The the grab trap? No, it's infinite. It's it's the best fucking thing in the game. It's so good. I'm a big fan of that shit. I'm gonna put all the rocks in here, I guess. This will be my rock thing. Okay, and then what will I put in here? I'll put things that are I'll just have this be like rocks and minerals and shit and the other one will be non minerals slash rocks <laughs> that'll be my my sorting strategy this will how I, that'll be how I separate it out do, do, do. why do I fucking have this it's just cluttering up the floor <laughs> am I stupid don't answer that don't answer that jackal <laughs> by the way you're saying your power is going to jump back up I think that was wrong lol yeah it doesn't do a lot of jumping I wouldn't say it's more like uh slowly, slowly, uh, repairing 
the damage that I was doing to it. Um, I guess I could put diamonds and rubies in a separate place than the rocks. I don't know, that seems a little bit excessive. Fuck, I have so much good shit after going to the Aurora. So, that's not rocks, that's not rocks. I'm just gonna drop this fucking microscope. Why did I even pick it up? Was I fucking high when I played this game last time? By the way, if anything really funny happens, I'm clipping it now. Oh shit. Is it because my leg's in the shot? Is that what you're saying? Don't fucking put my legs in it, because we're all alone and other people need to see it. Yeah, that- I, I appreciate that, honestly. Um, locker... I, I really think I should put up the uh, Subnautica stuff from the first playthrough. I, I had a really good time doing that. I'm, I I know these lockers are not evenly spaced, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to fucking move this locker so it's in the middle after a second. So this will just, I'll just put everything in this fucking locker. Dude, I just got the fucking Pokemon music in my head now. The first playthrough was awesome and I had a lot of fun watching it and kind of participating. What do you mean kind of participating? I call screaming at me to not die over and over again par definitely participating. <laughs> Just like uh, sports fans, you know? They're all participants. That's that's the common consensus about sports fan rights. Sports fans, right? I don't know a lot about sports, so I can't really say that I would know. I'm being super OCD about lining this thing up now. So this will be... These two right ones will be rocks. All the fucking rocks. Drop some rocks in there. And I'm counting titanium ingots as rocks because they're just clumped together rocks. You don't watch the sports ball? No, I'm I'm not a, I'm not as nearly as big of a sports ball fan as I used to be. After I went to college, I couldn't keep up with the uh, the good sports ball team anymore. Uh, you know, it just it wasn't in the cards, man. Uh, okay, so now this shit should just be not rocks, basically, right? Put all the batteries in there. I'm gonna just drop this fucking poster. Why did I even have this poster? I guess maybe when my base gets really fucking fancy, I can like decorate it, but I don't know, man. I'm I'm too fucking function over form. I'll keep the Aurora miniature though, because that's really cool. The board, the best sorting system, rocks and not rocks. Hey, look, man, you gotta start somewhere. You know, fucking. You think Darwin was like like starting out being like, oh, that's the fucking that kind of finch and that kind of finch. He's just like, no, that's a burb. <laughs> I know burbs. <laughs> Okay, and now, to make this thing symmetrical, I'm gonna move this fabricator, because I'm just not a fan of its current location. Man, that's- I really wish those two things were the same size. I am just an aesthetic perfectionist. You have a message on your phone, I heard it, and I agree with them being the same size, yeah. Uh, it is Pat saying, change your Twitch details. <sighs> I did. I changed it, I think. Jackal, tell me, did I- is it- is the title and stuff changed? Yeah, it's changed. Okay, I don't know why Pat's- pinging me telling me I need to update it still. So given that this we're super deep underwater, I don't really know like what the the answer is regarding like um the the power shit. I don't know what the policy should be for like the power situation. He needs to restart his Twitch. Yeah. Pat, come on, get your Twitch game. You, you need to get your Twitch game up to speed with me, dude. I'm super good at Twitch. I'm super good at Twitch. Okay, I need my flashlight. I forgot. Because the flashlight is not that great. I mean, the I, I have the, the Sea Glide flashlight, but, like, if you even, if you, like, compare them, it's, like, not even comparable. Like, look at that versus that. <laughs> like, it's just not even close to comparable in terms of light produced. Oh, man. There's a giant quartz thing. Um, it's not the cutting tool, is it? Because I think my next goal should be to get power somehow. But we're, like, right at the cusp of where you can even get solar power. I guess I should look for, like, thermal th things, I guess. I mean, it's not the end of the world if my base is constantly on low power. It's not like the oxygen doesn't get produced. Are you sure that it does not let off heat? Uh, I don't know. There's there's suit attachments later on that tell you, like, what temperature you are and stuff. Uh, I don't know. It's got, like, gold stuff in it. Maybe it's got heat. I could test it. Um, how would I test it? I could put... Where's the exterior modules? Uh, thermal, I have aerogel, magnetite, and titanium. I think I have all that shit. Yeah, so it's not the end of the world that my power is fucking low. I just won't be able to use my fabricator while I'm charging batteries. <laughs> but you know, that's fine. Do I have magnemite or magnetite in here? No, I do not. Or maybe it's in the other rocks chest. Nope, I don't. So, I guess, I, I know there's a hole in somewhere around here that I can go in to get that stuff somewhere along the bottom. 
my sense of direction is all fucked. I remember, like, right before I got off, I, like, knew where most things were, and I, like, could find my way. Um, uh, yeah, I just got Pokemon on the brain. Do I have Magnemite? Yeah. Um, but, yeah, before I got off, I, like, knew my way around, and I, like, knew where I was going and stuff, but now that I'm coming back to it, I just have no fucking clue anymore. Is this... Am I in a cave? No, I'm not. Okay. Did I make the Seamoth? No, I did not. Because I'm nervous about going this far away from my base without a Seamoth. Because the Seamoth allows you to, like... Oh, I need water anyway. Uh, I guess I should look for Bladderfish. I guess that's my new number one priority so I don't die of thirst. Um, is that the pod? That's where the Bladderfish are. So I'll just head over there then. My Carly. Carly's not there, so I'm just going to have to cut my losses with that Carly camp for right now. Do, 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 do. Well, I mean, Jackal, can you put something in the chat so that uh, I can see if the chat box still works with this scene, with this view? Because I don't know if I've used this view before now. Ah, saw, so, dude, yeah. Nice, thanks. Looks like it's working. Dude, the, uh, the low latency thing is great. Honestly, that's amazing. Is there any downsides to using it? I guess, like, if you're trying not to be stream sniped or something in, like, a multiplayer game, I guess it makes sense. But for Pat and I's purposes, I don't think. You were clipping Magnemite stuff? That wasn't even that funny! I just said the wrong word! <laughs> oh. Um, yeah, but, uh, I don't remember what I was saying. Something. And I'm sure it was hilarious, too. I still can't type fast enough. It was funny to me, lol. Uh, yeah. It's, it's fair. I mean, I, I'm not gonna, hey, man, if you say you find the shit I say funny, there's, who am I to be like, no, no stupid. <laughs> don't like the content I create. <laughs> That'd be a bit, uh, fucking weird. Okay, so I know there's Magnetite down here. I know there is. There's also these fucking eel things that eat my ass. Yeah, those things. My, the bat battery's gonna die soon, you just gotta make another one. Or, yeah, this battery's gonna die soon, but I have others in my inventory. I have four. I can just switch it out. So that's definitely, I could get thermal energy out of that, but my base is nowhere near here. Detecting an artificial structure somewhere in this region. Is that... What is that? I saw something over here. Fuck it. No, I gotta go back and get a bladder fish. This is... I'm playing with fire. Man. So how much do you know about the story of this game? Can I talk about stuff without spoiling it? Or have you... Are you, like, not that familiar with the story? Uh, and as Welsh would say, just drink the water. You good, go ahead. Uh, so, like, later... Oh, ooh, there's bladder fish. Later on in the game, you find out that uh, there's, like, microbes and shit in the water that are, like, uh, infecting you and stuff. I think the only difference between cooked fish and like purified fish or whatever, or the only difference between like regular water, like filtered water and purified water, is that purified water will um, uh, remove all the microbes. So I always thought like, you know, if you only drink purified water and not filtered water, you'll like have a more an advantage later on in the story because you like have ingested less microbes or whatever. But um, that's not right because it uh, doesn't give a shit. It's just scripted that you, it turns out that you were fucking infected no matter what. Where am I going? I'm going to this place to get bladderfish because bladderfish only spawn around my fucking escape pod. And I needed water because I was about to dehydrate to death. That's what I was trying to do. Um, and I don't, I have a rotten fish, which I don't care about. Um, okay. But if I go back to that little cave area that I was in, um, there's the blueprints for a water purifier, which automatically produces, like, drinkable water on, like, a set interval, which is super good. I think my ca my plan should be to go to this cave, um, that's between the escape pod and my beacon, and then go to that, go to that cave, get magnetite, and then also, um, look for the blueprints for the water purifier. Have I? I'm pretty sure I've checked that crash out, right? There's no way I would've just walked by this thing, or swam by this thing. Yeah, I can already see the hole in the door. Calm down, I hear you growling over there. My dog's just knocked out on the floor, dude. You really made sure you pronounced that correctly. I mean, I don't know why you would think that I took a... I was really deliberate about pronouncing magnetite or anything. I see you, you stupid fucking hidey hole. Don't think you get in one over on me. Um, yeah, I... I don't know what you mean. I was not being deliberate about pronouncing magnetite for any reason. <laughs> Wait, I think I went too far? I must have, I think I swam past that cave entrance that I was trying to shoot for. Here's salt, too. It's funny, one of the, ow, what hurt me? Oh, it's just a piranha. Yeah, Carly came back, so we got Carly camp back on. She was zonked on the floor, but now she's zonked under my desk. She's just a cute little pepperoni, dude. 
I'm a big fan of hers. Where's this hole? There's just a hole in the ground somewhere around here, right? Oh, there it is. I see it. I should just make beacons for things, because that way I don't have... Yeah, because I changed the cam because Carly was gone. Um, but I should just put beacons in places so I don't have to rely on my shitty sense of direction to find things again. It's so bright out. Damn. Yeah, up on the surface it's real bright. Are you talking about, like, in real life? Did you just, like, walk outside for the first time and you're like, Ah, the sun! <laughs> Oh, or is it that, like, I'm on the East Coast and then you're noting a time difference? Oh, yeah, in the game. There's the magnetite. Magnetite. To... So somewhere around here. Yeah, this is... You see, like, man-made little thingies. Where some of the survivors tried to set up an outpost here and then got squished and shit. Yeah, I, I need to make the fucking Seamoth. Because if I had the Seamoth, I could, like, explore this whole thing. The reason I was late for stream was because I was at work. I can't see your air and stuff, so I don't know when to yell at you. Oh, whoops. Let me switch over to this one. Hold on, I gotta turn this off. Come over here, turn that on. Nope, turn this off. Turn. You get, you, only, only this, only this Carly cam works for some reason. The right camera does not want to work for some reason. Yeah, I actually went into the windowed mode. Um, yeah, it's fine. So, I guess maybe I can't explore that cave too early, or like this early because I don't have the Seamoth yet. It's really fucking hard to explore it. I guess I could make a habitat down there like I did with the other one and use the um, geothermal thing that I see. I don't know. It's either I make a habitat down there or I make the sea moth. You have the blueprint. Let me see. What do I need for the sea moth? Let's see. Power cell is the only thing I'm missing. Which I think I can make a... I can just make it actually, right? Hold on. I need to go to the... the I need to get creep vine stuff. And then I can make the sea moth basically. Yeah, I think it is Seamoth time. I have a whole bunch of Seamoth upgrades, too. Um, do I have the blueprints for the moon pool? Um, where's the moon pool? No, I do not. Well, it's fine. I can just do the thing where I fucking <laughs> use, just make disposable batteries. Yeah, because I need... I make the lubricant out of the little glowing things, right? And then... And my weapon, my vehicle station is by this base, right? Carly turned around for us. Yeah, she's a cutie. For some reason, the, that other side of the camera doesn't want to work. She's, she's got it sorted out. If I can't get the camera to work, I could always just spin her around. <laughs> she would not like that. She would fucking leave. This is on second monitor, monitor and it's muted, but Carly looks amazing right now. Yeah, she's really cute. I love her so much, dude. Yeah, she's a cutie pie. She's just snoozing. I shouldn't be loud because she's asleep. There's no chat delay. Yes, that's correct. Captain. <laughs> His batteries are still not charged. This is so sad. Dude, whatever. If I was just trying to get water, I would. that would be a full fucking time job in this game. I don't see the vehicle bay up here, Jackal. Oh no, it just hadn't spawned in yet. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't have doubted you. You you, you always got my back, man. I should, I should have known better than to doubt you. I don't know why I'm here. I totally can't make it yet. I need to actually go get the stuff. Told you it was there. So I have glass, titanium ingot. I need to go make the lead and power cell. So I need to combine two batteries, I think. Hold on, to make a power cell, do I need anything besides... It might just be, like, batteries and rubber or something? Oh my god, I need rubber. Ugh. I should have gotten creep vine. I should have, like, gotten the... Wait, how do I make rubber? It's not out... That's not... Is it out of... Is it out of the green stuff? Because I thought the green stuff got turned into that, like, fiber mesh. I'll look at the ingredients for rubber here in a second. But I can definitely make the lubricant. Hey battery charger can you uh not for just one second thanks i guess i just gotta wait till the morning let's look at the blueprint for rubber and lubricant oh they both require one and i have two so it's perfect it's unpowered but it says power one do i have to like get out and come back oh god this is so sad dude this is just a real sad time can i can i just plug my batteries back in to the power thing and be like hey can you get more power it takes more than one power to make shit, Brian. Look, man, this game, who, I, I didn't ask for this game to be hyper-realistic, okay? I just wanted a place to do exposure therapy for my deep-seated uh, marinophobia, or whatever it's called. I'm just terrified of marines. You guys know any campfire tunes or anything? Well, all, what all power options are there? There's geothermal, there's biological i can like burn shit actually i should just make a bioreactor fuck it you know what there's no reason for me not to do it uh, bioreactor what i thought for sure i already had it oh no it's right there uh lubricant wiring kit and titanium 
Look at this big fucking thing. It goes in the multi-purpose room, which I don't have yet. But you can make electricity out of, like, plants and shit. Um, the middle one? Oh, that's a, I think it's a transmitter. You can, like, wirelessly transmit energy. Because I'm just about to fucking dehydrate to death. Actually, certain fish give you water, right? I guess I could just eat so much fish <laughs> that I, uh, rehydrate myself, I guess. I could just fucking kill all the life here. Just to survive the night, man. Come on. So why not make a base up top and put solar panels up there and transport it down? Hmm. Hmm. You know, you're making a lot of sense, dude. I actually, honestly, my base is not doing... It's not like... There's not that big of a reason for my base to be down this deep to begin with. Um, I guess the reason was so that I could hang out down deeper and have access to stuff, like having an oxygen pocket down here. But if I'm about to get the Seamoth, then it doesn't really matter, right? Because I can just use the Seamoth as like a mobile oxygen pocket. So I'm gonna, I might just move my whole base up closer to the surface. That's why I'm here. Yeah. Oh shit, I'm almost out of oxygen. And if you just want an oxygen bucket, why build a whole base instead of one room? Uh, I think that's the reason why it was one room initially. Um, but uh, I decided to expand it because everything was getting real cluttered. It sort of became a base later on. So I could build it. I'll just wait until morning and then um, uh, build the Seamoth in the morning. Actually, I could go to the escape pod and convert the stuff to rubber. Don't panic when you hear 30 seconds. That is what always kills you. I think what kills me is the uh, lack of oxygen, honestly. If I was a uh, autopsyologist, I would say that that's the what what does me in most of the time. Brian, shut the fuck up. Yes, sir. I'll get back in my cave. 